Well, he's delighted children all over the world as the Blue Wiggle. And now Anthony Field is taking on a new role, teaching kids and adults alike about the dangers of allergies as a spokesperson for Anaphylaxis Australia. And he and his son Antonio joined me here this morning. Very good morning to you both. Good morning, yeah. And Antonio, is this your little pal? Is this your puppy? Oh, <laughs> oh cute! <laughs> What's his name? Fergus. Fergus, right. Yeah. Well, Anthony, I mean, I know that this is an issue. I'm a bit scared of this dog. No, he's right, yes. <laughs> Good guard dog. He's very protective. This is an issue that's very close to your heart because Antonio... <laughs> Is it, does he like me or not like me? I can't it, work it, it it's, out. It's, it's just, he's just very protective, that's all, yeah. <laughs> but Antonio suffered a very severe allergic reaction to nuts when he was younger. That must have been harrowing for you. Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, I was on, on the road, actually, in New Zealand, and I got a phone call from Mickey, my wife, that uh, Antonio had had uh, a peanut butter sandwich, and, and for 18 months he was fine with that. And then uh, all of a sudden he's, um, he stopped breathing and he was scratching at his throat and he uh, broke out in hives, his lips swelled up, uh, basically found it very, you know, it was, it was a life-threatening situation and, we, and they called the ambulance and uh, little Antonio got taken to hospital and was there um, and basically they saved his life. Uh, we knew very little about being anaphylactic and also about uh, what you can do, um, you know, to help someone in that situation. Very interesting. You said that he'd had peanut butter before. Yeah, it was it was quite amazing. Um, he had a bit of a uh, he had the flu or something or a bad infection just before that. Yeah. Not sure if that's linked to it or not, but um, yeah. Uh, yeah. So he was all right till that moment, and then from then on, it's been a very uh, you know. It's fine if you take all the precautions, actually. Mm -hmm. yeah. And he, has he had any other attacks since? He's had another one since, and he's also uh, uh, allergic to uh, locust bean paste, which yeah. is uh, in, yeah. found in some jellies. Mm -hmm. um, we, we've, we've got friends who have also anaphylactic children, and uh, mm -hmm. uh, I think the, 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 the uh, best thing to do is, is uh, education. And, and the preschool mm -hmm. that Anto goes to, little Antonio goes to, the teachers there all know how to operate the EpiPen and, uh, uh, you know, they know all the, all the steps taken. All the parents there have been clued in also. Do not put peanuts or if, if, if children have uh, sesame uh, allergies and things like that, mm. um, don't put them in the lunchbox and things like that. You yeah. know? I imagine it's something now that pretty much every school has to be across. You've got the EpiPen with you. Can you show us how it works? Yeah, well, the good thing is, yeah, if you've, if you've got a child that's anaphylactic, even if you don't, at the school, practice using it because in the panic situation, uh, you, you might, you know, forget how to use it. So we make it a bit of fun, you know, and mm. Antonio, are you ready? Okay. You're going to so, show me, Antonio? Yeah, do you want to do it on me or do you want me to do it on you? Okay, I'll do it on you. Okay, you've just had a peanut butter sandwich or some peanut and you didn't know you were going to have it. Okay, so, ready? You fall over. You have to act now, Antonio. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what Dad's you telling over. you to do. What happens when you have an attack? Oh, he gets a bit sick and <laughs> falls over. So I take off this blue thing here yeah. and we go on the side of the, of the leg and we put it in and it clicks. Yep. And you hold it for how long, Anto? How many? Ten seconds. Cat's got your tongue this morning. You were talking <laughs> One, in the ad break. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, mm. and there we are. And he, the adrenaline kicks in, and uh, how quickly does that work? Uh, pretty quick, actually. You know, when it's yeah. yeah coming back, you know, and uh, mm. but they feel so lackadaisical and so lifeless. Mm. Um, this will save lives. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Antonio, is it pretty cool having a dad who's a wiggle? <laughs> <laughs> I bet it is. I bet there's nothing cooler at school. And what is next? What's happening for the, with the Wiggles in 2012? Oh, lots of things. You know, I just keep saying, I say that every year. Lots of things I don't know, you know. But I, I'm really enjoying a month off and spending time with these guys, so my children yeah. and Fergus, the, the uh, incredibly neurotic fox terrier. Yeah, the, the dog that's been scaring me all morning. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Not working out for a friend or foe yet. Well, look, Anthony... He's coming over for a leak. There Here we go. go. Oh, it's going to take a while, but, but yeah. I knew he'd come round. Um, Anthony, thank you so much for coming no in worries. this morning. Yeah. Antonio, you're a superstar. Do you reckon you might be a wiggle one day too? Yeah, yeah that sounds yeah. good, I doesn't think it? for Spider-Man, to be honest with you. <laughs> well, thank you, Anthony, no for worries. coming in this morning.